my name is Pascal Lessard. Uh, we're continuing our French lesson series. Today we're going to learn how to conjugate verbs in the past tense, passé composé, using avoir, to have. Most verbs are conjugated with avoir, but some are conjugated with to be. And this will be our next lesson. So today you're going to learn to use irregular verbs and very common verbs used almost every day. So learn this list and you should be good to go. So enjoy this class. The past tense, le passé composé, avec avoir. César dit, je suis venu. J'ai vu, I have seen. J'ai vaincu, I have conquered. Always remember that le passé composé is composed of two things. Uh, the auxiliary, in this case uh, using avoir, and the past participle. Though some verbs are uh, conjugated with être, state of being and movement verbs like come, go, become, be born. So here you have an example, tu as mangé, conjugated with avoir, versus je suis devenu, conjugated with to be. So, uh, but most verbs are conjugated with avoir, and these are the ones we're going to be looking at today. So, for regular verbs, verbs that follow a pattern, uh, like the uh, ER verbs, les verbes en ER, the past participle ends in E. J'ai mangé, j'ai marché, j'ai écouté. And for the ER verbs, um, it ends in E. So, j'ai fini, j'ai dormi, and RE, répondre, for example, j'ai répondu. Uh, so, you've got a few examples here. Les verbes en ER, j'ai mangé, j'ai marché, verbe en IR, tu as fini, tu as dormi, ending in I. Et les verbes en RE, rendre, il a rendu, il a entendu. You can check this site, it's a good one. Uh, this is a list of irregular verbs, but I'm going to give you another one because this one includes verbs conjugated with to have and others conjugated with to be, like these ones. So I don't want to mix you up. Um, this is the verb to have in the past tense. J'ai eu, I've had or I had. Tu as eu, il a eu, nous avons eu, vous avez eu, ils ont eu. So, I'm going to give you that list of uh, verbs that are used very, uh, almost every day. They're so common. And, but they're irregular. They don't follow a pattern, so you need to memorize them. I had to do that when I was learning English in high school. Uh, I had to learn lists like write, wrote, written, write, wrote, written, and verbs like that. So, j'ai été, I have been. Tu as eu, I have had, or I had. Il a fait. The verb to make, to do. Elle a pu. She was able to. Pouvoir. To be able to. Nous avons vu. Voir. Vous avez voulu. Vouloir. That's the, uh, the infinitive here in the past participle. Ils ont bu. Elles ont écrit. The list goes on. J'ai lu. Tu as su. Il a tenu, elle a reçu, nous avons ouvert, vous avez pris. So you see how different it is from the infinitive, so you really need to uh, memorize them. Ils ont compris, elles ont appris. So just stick those verbs on your fridge or... Uh, close to your car wheel when you're stopped at a red light or whatever. Uh, J'ai connu. Uh, connaître is usually when you know a, a person versus uh, savoir here 
is usually when you know a thing. It's the same thing in Spanish, Portuguese, or Italian. Um, so let's go back. Tu as dû, you had to, or the verb must in the past tense. Il a dit, elle a offert. Nous avons mis, we put, le verbe mettre. Vous avez vécu, you lived, like... Vous avez vécu en Espagne. You have lived in Spain. Ils ont ri. Elles ont cru. So this is an, an exercise we can work on together to practice. So here is the infinitive. You need to conjugate with avoir. So if you don't remember, well, il a marché. But you can go back to... Uh, this and just check how to conjugate uh, je like j tu tu as il a and then you just add the past participle so let's go back so here tu as fini elles ont répondu remember our, uh, verbs usually ends in u for when you conjugate the past participle so, j'ai vendu, tu as pris, elle a aimé, that's a regular verb. Nous avons réfléchi, regular with ir. J'ai travaillé, also regular. Tu as attendu, vous avez ouvert, that's irregular, it's on your list. So I hope this was useful and uh, this is usually hard for people who are learning French. So wish you the best, good luck, bonne chance and see you for our next lesson on le passé composé with être, with to be.